Hi and thanks for watching. I'm Skids. In this video we're going to go over some of the basics on Skids Prims. We're going to cover how to make a shape, what an active Skids Prim is, and how to work with the interface. To create a shape it's pretty simple. You just click one of the shapes on the HUD. It'll appear three meters in front of wherever your camera is pointed at that time. You do kind of got to be careful just a touch. Uh, it could end up behind an object and you might not be able to find it or even in the ground. I've seen it do that. You can always create a copy of a shape by holding shift and dragging a skids prim. This is the same as a uh, normal prim, so good tip there. You may notice that some of the shapes do appear to be missing on the HUD. Well, the shapes that are missing are just cut and tapered shapes of other shapes. These are the seven main shapes. The active prim. This is an important concept of the skits prim. Whatever prim you first touch to create the interface is the active skids prim. You'll see it flashing also to indicate which one is this active one at the time. Important to know about the active skids prim, it's the only one that will have changes applied to it. So if you want to change a different skids prim that has an interface around it, what you can do is just touch it it will become the new active skids prim. If you touch a skids prim that doesn't have an interface around it, it will get an interface. If you want to make it the active skids prim, all you have to do is touch it again and it will become the active skids prim. Touching the active skids prim again, it will remove all the interface pieces. Working with interfaces. The interfaces are very unique with the skids prims. All you do to create an interface is touch the skids prim you want to change. By default, you're in sensor mode and it will find prims around it and wrap interfaces around those. This even works with regular objects. If you change the skids prim, it will actually dynamically change the interface to match the new shape and new size. Touching an interface piece will turn it white indicating which one you touched. If you make a mistake, go ahead and touch it again to undo it. Not all modes use the interface. Snap, Gap, Rock Classic, and Rock Scale are the only ones that do. The others use dialog boxes. If you delete a skids prim that has an interface around it, or uh, the active skids prim, it'll actually remove the interface within 30 seconds. Thanks for watching, and uh, you can find the skids prims on Skids Isle. And uh, be sure to check out the rest of the videos in this series at www.skidsparts.com slash skids prims video. That's S-K-I-D-Z-P-R-I-M-Z-V-I-D-E-O.